developing this morning. Alameda County's in battle. District attorney is defending herself from new criticism, this time from Livermore's police chief. Today in the base, Pete Serratos joins us in our newsroom this morning. And Pete, this dispute surrounds just one particular case, right? Yeah, it does. And the Livermore police chief said he's not pleased with the current charges by the DA when it comes to this case. And he made this uh, very clear in a letter that he wrote to the DA. Now, according to Livermore police, 21 year old Colby Berry robbed two women at gunpoint. They say he violently attacked one of them for more than 30 seconds before stealing their purses. Now, police say Berry was on parole at the time for a shooting at a home back in 2021. They say his court ordered ankle monitor showed that he was actually at the scene of these robberies. Now, Livermore police eventually arrested Barry at his parole office in Oakland. And now the police chief wants the DA to add special enhancements to Barry's charges for using a firearm and being a repeat offender. Now here's Chief Young talking about the need for enhancements in this case, as well as a recent video statement by DA Price explaining her objection to enhancements. So if you have a record of, of committing violent crimes and, and you do it again, then there's, a, a, there's more of a consequence. Overusing enhancements has led to Alameda County having the fifth largest county jail in the world. Now, the DA's office says Barry is facing six criminal charges that could result in 13 years behind bars, and they claim if they follow the chief's advice on adding enhancements for Barry, it could result in 50 years to life. Now, Barry is still in custody at the Santa Rita County Jail with bail set at $360,000. The DA did mention they plan to meet with the chief next month.